double album, man. This is before All Eyes on Me. This is before Damn Life After Death. You know what I'm saying? So P had the double album first. Yeah, P had Down South Hustlers double album. P had Last Dawn double album. Right. And he had Good Side, Bad Side double album. That's yeah. three. True to the game, too. True to the game, double. Yeah. Uh, the Crime Family. Yeah, double. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so I'm yeah. just like, you know, give this dude respect, man. And everybody just keep, you know, they don't want to give him respect. I don't know why. Yeah. You know, I, I don't get it, you know, but we'll see, man. We will see. Uh, no Limit definitely uh, deserves a lot more credit in the game. Hell right? yeah, man. I fucks with him to this day, man. I always will, man. <laughs> always will, man. That's what's up, man. Shout out to Big Court, man. I swear I wish I could meet this dude, man. Oh, man. Big Court be holding down on uh, social media, man. He's mm -hmm. crazy. Um, Mr. Servo. Mm -hmm. Those are like people that you can like reach out to and touch, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Same thing with Jimmy Jump, man. Our official, oh, yeah, man. Yeah, Jimmy Jump. Man, oh, yeah. we be doing a documentary on Jimmy Jump. We're going to get it done, Jimmy Jump. If you, hit, if you watch this, man, we're going to get that documentary done for you, soldier. Yeah, yeah if you man. see this Jimmy, man, I remember they just call you, what, Desperado? Yeah, Desperado. Man. Yeah, South, West, Philly. Man, that dude, man, that dude was like short. my favorite member out, out yeah. of damn official, man. Yeah. Jimmy Jump, he's supposed to be working on some new music, too, so. Because I followed Four Boys Ballers album, man. He kept official was all over that album, man. That's that's another CD I didn't have in my damn case. I five oh four ballers album, man. Yeah. That album was so damn hard, man. <laughs> that song with official, man. That war official and yes, crazy. Yeah, y'all don't want to fuck with it, man. Yeah. <laughs> Jimmy said I brought my rhymes in the kitchen cause my balls is cooking. Uh. You fuck average bitches now the stars be looking. Niggas scared and they shook. I can tell by their face cause we hard to figure out like a lock to the safe. Come on, man. Oh, oh man, yeah. Yeah. That nigga be spitting that shit, man. Yeah, he do, man. He do. Jimmy. And people on my damn boat when I was in the Navy, like, damn, who the hell is that, man? Dude off of No Limit. They was like, yeah, right. I was like, hey, man. Right. Official, man. Right. They got that, that, that East Coast, man, that Philly, man. It's a whole different swag. Yeah, man. You know? And I just that. wish, I just wish them boys would have dropped the damn album, man. Because every song they was on, they killed that shit, man. Every single one. Right? When I first heard of them damn dudes, man. It was on damn C Murder's album Trapped in Crime, man. That's when I first heard official, man. Yeah. That's when I very, very first heard him, man. Yeah. Damn, yeah. man. They held, they held it down. I, 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 we put out a little petition, man, to, for Peter to release all of old tracks, man, of official. Yeah, so, man. Might as well, man. Shh, do Open it. the archives, P, man. Drop that official album, man. Hell yeah, man. <laughs> I mean, for real, man. I'll buy all of that shit, man. You can get my damn money, man. <laughs> It might be like one month at a time because I got kids, you know what I'm saying, Pete? <laughs> but, but you gonna get it. <laughs> hell yeah, man. Yeah, we gotta have that official album, man. Of course, man. And I was still waiting on the Down South Hustlers 2 album, Oh man. my goodness, I wanted that to come out so bad. Because, I, I mean, I tell you another album that I used to bang like crazy when I first moved up here to Virginia, man. Nobody else banged it but me. Was that that West Coast Bad Boys 2? Oh yeah. Man. Dedication to Tupac? Yes, man. Yeah, yeah. My God, man, that was a good ass album, man. Yeah. I used to bang the hell out of that album, man. And it was a damn tape. I didn't have the CD. I had, I still do get the tape. You rock the tape till it pop, bro. Hell yeah, man. Because <laughs> my card I had had a tape deck. I mean, now I got no tape deck in my damn shit now. You know right, what I'm saying? Right. But, man, that was a good album, man. Dang. Tank Gang. Yes, yeah, sir, man. If you if you could meet P, like, what, what, what would the discussion be? Or what would you like to ask him? Well, the first thing I would do was I would thank him. I'd be like... You don't know me, you know what I'm saying? But only if you knew you, some words that you said has brought me through so much in my trying times as a teenager becoming a man, Right. you know? And I respect your, your struggle and everything, you know what I'm saying? Because I remember one point in time, when me and my wife, you know what I'm saying, we was on food stamps, you know what I'm saying? We was, you know, electricity getting cut off and you know, water getting cut off and living in the projects and I had a job and everything, you know, but, you know what I'm saying, still had that damn no limit. And right. I would listen to that, you know what I'm saying, to cheer me up, you know what I'm saying, to make me feel good. And it was sort of like, it was sort of like the ghetto gospel, if you will. It was like the street gospel to, you know, even though I'm not from Louisiana, you know what I'm saying, but I felt it, you know what I'm saying. Everybody off the tank, they had that cer cer certain songs they had that would touch you, you know what I'm saying. Like, for real, for real, man. And I basically tell P, how the hell do you sleep? How, how do you sleep from 96 to like 99, especially in 98? Right. Because 98, that's when, in my opinion, No Limit took over, man. Right. Because people always say it was, it was 99. 
And I'm like, no. I said 98, 98 like every albums. every month an album was dropping, man. Yeah. You see murder drop. Every, every month. Me, me X drop. Damn Silk drop. Damn Big Ed drop. Damn Prime Suspects drop. Ghetto Commission drop. Kane and Abel drop. It was like the, every month something was dropping, man. And nobody else is doing that shit. Right. And I know all them boys up north, north were just like, how in the hell is this damn nigga from New Orleans doing this shit? <laughs> Well, we independent like yeah, that. Yeah, man. You know yeah, what I'm saying? We had no record company telling them you can't do this. And yeah, people watching boss. this, Google half this shit. A lot of these damn albums that went gold and went platinum. Right. Like, shout out to Dan Servon. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? His first one, Life Insurance, that went gold. His second album, The Next Level, that went platinum, man. Right. Platinum, okay? Right. You know, C when Murder I'm... shit went platinum. Silk shit went platinum. P shit went platinum. Right. You got three brothers, all day soul albums went platinum. Come on, man. <laughs> True to the Game, I think, went platinum too, man. True to the Game went like. Double platinum. Yeah, bro. man. 